Okay, what's up everybody? It is Genesis and it is like Saturday afternoon, early afternoon I think. Um, I'm at work and I'm just stepping out for another one of those I had this idea and I had to say something moment. Uh, and if you follow me on Twitter you'll see that I had like a whole thread talking before this so don't mind my at work look. Um, what I wanted to say just so I can have it out here and save it is that when you choose to grow it's up to you when you choose to elevate it's up to you and even if you don't do that the growth is up to you so if no one ever came up to you and said you know you have the option to elevate your consciousness to understand others better to be more in connected or more in connection with you know a higher power with the divine if no one ever said that to you it would still be up to you to handle what life has dealt you I'm not saying that we should be victim blaming and I'm not saying that, you know, if you're a kid watching this, like shit's your fault. I don't mean that in any way. Um, I spent a lot of time like thinking that stuff was my fault and it wasn't. But the choice is always yours to grow. The responsibility is always yours. I know that my parents were not always able to do for me what they might have wanted to. And I have discussed with them different like hurts and stuff in my life and have come to understand, you know, that they were also just people doing their best. So if I have issues with abandonment or maybe not the best relationship with money or how I would look at myself in the mirror, that's not my mom or dad's fault anymore. They may have set an example, but it's not their fault. It's up to me to handle how I deal with that. So when you are untangling things, especially because right now so much is coming up and people are like untangling a lot, when you are when you are untangling things, be gentle with yourself and other people and hold yourself accountable, but do so lovingly. Um, I'm going to post the thread that I shared on Twitter for this because it will like give a little more context, but, but your growth is up to you. Your reactions, which should be responses, are up to you. The way you choose to handle a situation, the way you choose to move forward from a situation is up to you. Um, and I'm not saying that from a point of, of not being in the middle of shit or not knowing how like it feels to, to have been hurt by people um, or to have been neglected by people who should have been taking care of you, who should have been teaching you, who you felt like should have prepared you more or differently. Um, and it can, be, it can be hard to be an adult or a young adult or whatever age you are if you see this and you're going through it. It can sometimes be hard to be like, fuck not only do I have to unlearn what I learned and like forgive or at least understand the people who put me in this situation but I now have to take it upon myself to get myself out of the situation and that can suck sometimes and you might feel some type of way about it and I understand that but realistically it's up to us so I just wanted to say that oh I said that because I had posted something that said you know you have a divine right to freedom, to knowledge, to wisdom, to compassion, to love, to information, to an abundance of all that the creator has given us to provide. But with those divine rights comes a fucking responsibility, comes accountability. Are you investigating yourself? Are you acting with awareness of your own um, emotions and the way you react to them? Are you, are you acting with awareness about your mindset, the narrative you're telling yourself? You know what I mean? Awakening requires awareness awakening requires accountability and reaping the benefits of divine right also requires accountability because if I know that these things are my divine right and if I understand that then isn't it also my responsibility to help make the world a better place for everyone else isn't it also my responsibility to help instill that knowledge of divine rights in other spaces which doesn't mean telling people how to live doesn't mean telling them who God is or what religion is or anything just letting them know hey bro it's all it's all real it's all connected you can live a more knowledgeable life all you have to do is pay attention to yourself and your interactions um that's all i had to say i gotta get back in there and get back to work so don't mind this face don't mind me uh i love you all so much drink lots and lots of water enjoy your cosmic new year remember to step outside of boundaries step outside of our concept of time and remember that there is a bigger intrinsic co cosmic timeline happening and yes i love you Okay, bye. Hi, bye. <laughs>